Welcome to this Fix It channel, and this is a quick video to uh, in in a series that I'll be making on software that are free that can replace paid software that exists. It's a question I get asked very often. Do you know of a free Photoshop or a free Microsoft Office or free this or that? And very often, um, you know, I tell them, well, there's no free versions of that but you can get equivalents that are free so today Photoshop uh, the software that I will be of course choosing in this series of free software is safe to install no hardware no malware open source most of the time and totally legal to use so if you want to do some image editing if you want to retouch images do some image manipulations there's a free open source software that is actually uh, almost as powerful as Photoshop and it also is compatible with Photoshop in many cases and it's called GIMP. GIMP has been around for a long time as you see here celebrating 20 years. It is an amazing piece of software. It works very well. It will let you of course uh, change or manipulate or you know modify all sorts of uh, images. If you're looking for something that you can use that's powerful uh, yet free to uh, do some uh, retouch on images and so on well this is the software GIMP lets you use layers and tools of all sorts there's filters you can import other filters of course you can uh, there's add-ons or extensions that can be added here um, there's online manuals so if you go to the GIMP website by the way there will be there are some tutorials I will post the link to this website by the way in the description below the video so that you can go and get the latest version at 2.8.16 by the way compatible with Mac with Windows and with Linux so this is pretty cool uh, also and it is a great great piece of software so all you have to do is open the file that you want to open uh, and you know just choose whatever you want to do and um, here we go. I can manipulate and do whatever <laughs> on an image. Um, like I said, it does have some compatibility with Photoshop, so it can have open some of the Photoshop files. But of course, like all free software, it's not 100% compatible. So that's something you need to know. Great piece of software. Check it out and uh, free of charge. If you have any comments, questions, suggestions, let us know and um, hopefully you'll enjoy this little series on free software to replace paid software and thank you for watching us on this channel